I am taking you in my pantry, literally. For me, like a garage and a pantry, oh, those get me really horny. A lot of the stuff in here I have for other people. The Lucky Charms is for Kylie and Mason, specifically. We just went to St. Bart's and Kylie eats Lucky Charms all the time. And she's like a three-year-old. She only picks out the marshmallows. So I wanted to show you guys how to do this task. It takes about five to 10 minutes. I buy my glass really pretty container that you could put anything in at Target and you could pick whatever cookies you want. As you could tell, I like containers. I like things to all kind of look the same and have some fluid flow to it. I've had some requests to do on my refrigerator. Come on and join me. <laughs> I am a big label maker. So if dad likes dad snacks, put a basket for dad. Have dad, have mom. Yes, I know it's an extra expense to buy containers or to buy baskets, but it makes everything so pretty and it's a one-time thing. I love to be a hostess, so I think when you are stocking your pantry, you need to think about your guests too that come over frequently, and that's definitely what I do. So there is a method to the madness when it comes to placing everything in your refrigerator. One, the top shelf is normally used for drinks. Like you pay your rent, you're gonna redo your cookie jars. Hello, that's <laughs> normal. So we are just gonna place all the way around on the edge and we're gonna work our way in. And I like double stuffed because they just look better because they're thicker. we're good to go. So without me doing the in the middle, I've used about four and a half boxes of Oreos. Voila. You don't have to spend a lot of money in order to organize, so don't give me the excuses, people. And I like to kind of organize by category, like these are all my crackers or cookies on this side, and also these are the things that I think I would grab the fastest. 